This week on The Wire, home buyers want help, tree changes drive regional prices, and demand for housing still strong. G'day guys, my name's Tim Guest, and welcome to The Wire, the week in real estate. You can get all the top stories happening this week in finance, real estate, investment, and more. Now please like, comment, and share this video, and if it's your first time tuning in, don't forget to follow or subscribe wherever you are seeing this. So our top story for this week, home buyers want help. There are plenty of prospective home buyers out there, but they want professional advice and guidance in these uncertain times, and that's according to mortgage broker Aussie. In a survey conducted by Aussie, more than half of prospective home buyers want guidance with property and finance. Uncertainty is the biggest challenge for 42% of the 1,000 people surveyed. They want to take advantage of the current conditions of the real estate market, but they don't know how to. Aussie Chief Customer Officer David Smith says the result is missed opportunities and unrealised goals for potential home buyers. In a market which sees prices in some capital cities continuing to fall, interest rates remaining the lowest on record, a range of refinancing options, access to lender cashback incentives and a range of government initiatives and grants available, there are many opportunities for both first home buyers and homeowners to secure their goals, he says. A number of significant, uh, sorry, a significant number of respondents said COVID-19 was responsible for making their property goal more important now and accelerating their plans. Now for our next story, tree changes drive regional prices. So regional areas in the eastern states are booming as city residents seek uh, a sea or tree change to escape a restrictive coronavirus lifestyle and as working from home becomes the new norm. REA Chief Economist Nerida Connersby says, since COVID-19 lockdowns began, there has been an interesting shift in search activity to regional New South Wales. The Richmond Tweed appeal appears to be driven by white collar nomads released from the shackles of their CBD offices. Since June, the Master Builders Association of Victoria has noticed spikes in demand in the three regional cities closest to Melbourne, as well as in Shepparton and Wodonga. NBA Victorian Chief Executive Rebecca Casson says the new normal of working from home has combined with the $25,000 home builder grant and $20,000 in bonus grants for first home buyers who build a home outside of the city to rejuvenate the regions. Other reports state that people are buying properties in South East Queensland, often sight unseen. The overall result is increased demand which is driving up prices, says Connersby. And now for our final story of the week, demand for housing still strong. So underlying demand for housing remains strong despite the pandemic, says one of Australia's oldest builders, A.V. Jennings, Managing Director and CEO Peter Summers. The national housing developer had expected a strong 12 months to June, but land sales dropped back from March when COVID-19 struck. Before March, sales momentum had been fairly strong after recovering from the earlier impacts of the bushfires, Summers says. Following a low uptake of fewer than 60 contracts in each of March and April, A.V. Jennings signed 80 contracts in May and 100 in June. As a result, the developer into the current financial year with 385 contracts on hand on par with a year ago, with a further 76 sales recorded in July. Summers says the home builder scheme hasn't created demand, but it has underpinned and motivated buyers to move forward with their purchases. The housing market is all about confidence. Price moderation and stimulus provided the opportunity for first home buyers who tend to act quickly. Summers also says the second lockdown in Victoria has not had a huge impact on demand. Well, guys, they're the top stories for the week. Now, please don't forget to comment, like, and share this video, or follow or subscribe wherever you're seeing this. Have a great week, guys, and remember, there's only one thing in life that makes a difference, and that's action. Thanks a lot, and bye for now.